Hey guys, this is Versatile from Game Dexterity. Um, in today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how simple it is to play Supreme Commander 2 online using the LAN feature, and we're going to use Smart Steam. Now, for purposes of this tutorial, I am sitting in the Tungle Room because it just makes it easier to coordinate your LAN games with other gamers. But of course, you don't have to use Tungle. You can use whatever you want, and if you don't know, Tungle is just a VPN gaming program that allows you to play PC games that has LAN functionality over to inter internet with your friends or whoever. So just see the more info section. I got more detailed instructions there. So let's jump straight into the gameplay video. All right, so here we are at the main menu of Supreme Commander 2. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to multiplayer and we're gonna go to join game. And we see that someone is already hosting a game. So we just click their game, click on join LAN and we're good to go. Sorry, join game and we're good to go. So here we are in the main game lobby. So we just sit here and wait for the host to do his thing. And then momentarily the game will start. Sweet, so here we are in the game. We can clearly see that it works. This is not bull crap, you know, it's not BS. And here we're gonna type a quick message to the other player just to say, yeah, this does work. And um, we're gonna have a lot of good times today. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're going to end the game. So let's click on yes. And we're gonna show you how simple it is to host the game as well. So you go to multiplayer and then you go to host game. You know, name the game whatever you want and then click on host game. Wait for the other player to join your game. Go ahead and set up any type of settings that you want for your particular game or for your particular match. And then once everyone is ready, click on launch and we're good to go. Sweet, so here we are in the game. Uh, just like the other portion of the video, this does work. Um, there's no lag unless you are living very far from the other gamers. And we're just gonna type a very quick message to the other player just to show you that this is not scripted. This is not some robot that we're playing with. This is real people, people that are just like you and me in the Tungle Room or whatever gaming program you are using. So with that said, let's go straight back to the desktop. So we can clearly see that the game works out fine. I'll just go to the more info section. I got all the instructions there. I'm not gonna waste your time or my time just showing you all the different steps. If you need help hosting a game, definitely port forward UDP 11155 if you're using the Tungle program. If you got any other questions, go ahead and leave a comment here on the YouTube page and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care, bye.